And I'm here with a friend. What's your name? I'm Gussing. Gussing? Gussin, right? Gussing. Gussing? Whatever, okay. Okay, cool. And I'm gonna tell her what the difference between a solicitor and a barrister is. Do you know what the difference is? No. Okay, that's what that's what I'm here for. All right. So, a solicitor, solicitors and, bar and barristers are both types of lawyers, right? Okay. So, a solicitor basically does conveyancing which is preparation of legal documents primarily for the purpose of transferring property. Um, it, they also do work uh, regarding family matters and commercial matters. Um, they advise individuals and organizations on, on legal matters. Um, they are also governed by this body called the Solicitor's Regulation Authority. Okay, and now we're going to talk about barristers. Barristers basically work in high levels of court and they defend people in court and advocate in legal hearings. Um, they receive instructions through solicitors and are governed by the Bar Standards Board. So the main difference between solicitors and barristers is that solicitors are more advisory and barristers defend in court. So one favorite question is, can, do you think clients can sue barristers if they don't do a good job? Yes. Yes, the answer is correct. However, this wasn't the case in the first place. The case of Rhonda and Worsley at first said that barristers cannot, um, that barristers are actually immune from negligent suits. So that means like if you're not happy with the outcome of a case, you can't sue the lawyer that defended you. But, um, and this was because of the floodgates argument uh, that said that if, uh, if people could sue, then everybody would want to sue for an unsatisfactory outcome. All right, but this was reversed in the case of Arthur and J.S. Hall and Simmons, um, where the Court of Appeal reversed this decision and held that barristers can indeed be sued um, for negligence. So all that ha all that has to happen is that a judge has to hear the case and then they can decide if the barrister is liable or not. So yes, that's the difference between a solicitor and a barrister. And now you also know that barristers can be sued if a case has an unsatisfactory outcome. Cool, so now that we have that out of the way, <laughs> how, was, how, how was the presentation? Mm, I 
something very good. Oh, thank you. It's informative. Oh, great. Did you did you like understand like what was going on? Uh, a bit. Uh. A bit. Mm. Okay, that's great. That's all that matters. Um, is there anything that I can improve? No, very good. Perfect. Wow, thanks. It's great. Okay.